Hello everyone, myself I am Uma and I have overall 8 plus years of IT experience as a data analyst and 4 years of experience as a corporate trainer. I am a Microsoft certified data analyst currently working at Microsoft. Hi everyone, welcome to KSR Data Vision YouTube channel. In today's session we will learn about two more DAX functions that is if function and switch function. Okay, so here is the case study. So I have lo loaded one table here. Let's see the table. We have different customers and region IDs for their customers. But we don't know what is one, what is two, what is three and what is four. Now I have to create one region name column for this. This is only the region ID, but what exactly is that region? I want to create one column for all these customers, right? Almost I have 9,993. For all these customers, I have to give the region names. OK, for all these values for that, the use case is given. If the ID is one, automatically that customer should get the region name as South. Two, then he has to get the region name as Central. Three, East, four and West. So now let's try to create the logic for this. So I'm going to create one new column called region region column using if condition. So here I will try to use the if condition. So I'm using the if DAX condition. Now I will try to check the condition. If region ID, if it is equal to one, then I will give the condition as south region. Okay. Now again, I have to write one more if since I'm using if right, this is the syntax. Again, I have to use one more if to check the next condition that is. Region ID. If it is equal to two, then I have to give the region as central. The same way. Again, I have to write one more if condition to check whether my region ID. If it is equal to three. Then again, I have to give some condition that is East region. Same way either directly I can write West means the left option is West or again I can write in condition saying if. If function. If the region is four, then give the best region. Okay. Now while closing this check, how many if conditions I have written here? One if for this I need to close here. One more if this also I have to close the parentheses. This is one more if one more if. So for all this four ifs I have used. So four I need to close one, two. 3, 4. Okay. So if you observe, right, somewhat it is confused, right? You are confused. So many ifs you are writing, so many you have to close this. And every time, if again inside nested if, again inside this one more if, like that, multiple if conditions you are using, isn't it? Somewhat it is confusing for you, but let's see what is the result. I clicked on. Enter now if you see one new column is created now quickly. Let's see what is the column it created. See whatever based on the condition I have given four means best region. If I take only three one I will take one. If I take south region I'm getting I'll take two two if I take central. So whatever condition I have given three east. Four is best. So based on all the conditions I have given automatically it is creating. OK, finally you achieved your result, but somewhere it is multiple if conditions you are using and while closing this and the syntax is little bit tough for you, right? To overcome this problem when you have multiple conditions, you can also use switch function. So now let's achieve the same thing using switch function, OK? So again, I'm trying to select the same uh, table. Now I'll go for new column and now I'll give. 
region column using switch okay so the syntax is i am directly using the switch function now and here i'll write the condition true condition for all the true conditions no more ifs no more ifs directly i can give my logic my expression i can give my expression is region id if it is equal to 1 i can directly give it's a south region if region id again i am not using if condition directly i am checking here okay region id if it is equal to 2 then it is central the same way again i can give region id if it is equal to 3 i can give the region as east and remaining i can directly give west or i can again write this condition if the region id equal to 4 it is west region okay so for in the switch what i am doing for every true if it is true if region id equal to 1 directly in that new column it will give the south if the region id equal to 2 directly central 3 east and 4 means west just i can directly close this no more multiple ifs and no more multiple parentheses for closing directly i will click on enter if you see now one more column is created now this column we have created using the switch function okay now if you go and see the table same results only you are getting results are same okay you can create the region either using the if condition or the switch condition but see the flexibility right which one is easy if you are seeing this if condition somewhat you are finding it complex because multiple ifs you are seeing here multiple ifs as well as multiple closing parentheses somewhere you get confused but using switch function easily i am giving if this is the condition give me this value if this is the condition give me this value this is the condition this value okay um let me know in the comment box which uh, function is easy for you whether it is if or switch okay thank you for watching this for more informative videos please do like share and subscribe to ksr data vision youtube channel thank you